morning everybody we are on the road we're headed south we're meeting up with uh, Bow River bank robbers we're gonna be uh, hitting the river chasing rainbows and browns it looks like a beautiful day a little overcast the temperatures coming up every day I think uh, in the next couple days it's supposed to get up to 17 I think today is supposed to be around 15 16 so beautiful spring morning so let's see if we can get on some browns and some bows, so stay tuned. It's gonna be a great day. We'll see you on the water. Nick's got us on this bank. We're just pounding it. We're looking for browns and rainbows. So we're just retrieving fairly slow with a nice little twitch. It's the live target right now. And just getting it kind of in that two foot range off the bank. I guess it's pretty shallow there. So hopefully we find one. Beautiful rainbow. Check them out on the live target. Missed the nice brown earlier. But. That will happen. Beautiful rainbow. There he goes. The live target, right? Her uh, brown trout worked perfect. We're testing out the new Streamside uh, Predator Apex medium rod, and it performed perfect. Just pounding the banks. Let's go find another one. Being small. It might not be as small as I think you could. <laughs> Get him over into the soft water. Oh no! Oh, nice one. Oh no! Oh, I still got him. Oh, <laughs> they jump like that, man. He wants. <laughs> He's giving my five weight a little bit of a problem here. Don't, don't jump. Oh, you jump. Getting tired. Yeah, he was silvered up for sure. Now we got, the only downside with these long leaders is you got a little bit of a... Oh, he sees the boat, he's not going to want to. He's not, he's not, he's not, oh no, he's not shaking, oh no. I'm gonna come over, over here, buddy. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's a nice fish. Yeah, that's a good one. It is a beauty. Oh, he wants water skiing. I don't want to rip that hook out of his mouth here. That's no part of this net. That's no part of it. Get back out here. That's as far as I can go up with them. Thank you. Got some chads here. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> beauty fishing. That's a beauty. <laughs> Uh, we took that five way for a little rip. Beautiful 20 inch plus. 
We hooked into a ton of fish this morning and uh, stopped for a quick lunch break. Nick's uh, girlfriend made us some phenomenal wraps. I think it was uh, chicken, crispy chicken, bacon. I don't know what else it is, but do you need more? It was spicy and delicious. So let's get back to fishing. I just wanted to get that in there. Cause, man, when you go with him, he's gonna feed you right. It's nice getting out from the fish. It's not all. Come on. I got to snap off. I like already heard on this little guy. That's a little brown. Little guy. Strong. See you, dude. Brown rainbows, let's get your big brother. Bitch is hooked up here, right? Hooked up right where he's supposed to be. Yep, found the bank right where the foam is. We nice. actually made a comment when we passed it this morning that, you know, it looks like pretty fishy. Yeah, it's a nice brown. Oh, that is or a is nice a fish. Brown. Yeah, it is. I seen some yellow on him, buddy. He was right where he was supposed to be. Yeah, he was colored up. <laughs> He's strong when they get in that current, right? Yeah, he still got a lot of time before we get into some dicey water, but. Now we're good. He's coming. That's a beauty. Oh, muscle. That's a chunk. Chunker. That's a good fish. Ooh. Yeah, that's a good fish. Oh, right there. look at the. Oh. Don't. Yes! Oh, Let's go! A beauty! Down on the live target right where he should have been in some uh, heavy foam. A little water break, but we're going to get this in the water here. Hey everybody, the gear we're using today for a spinning rod was the Predator Apex from Streamside. It's a 610 medium, extra fast, and just picking up this rod, you could, it's Great rod, super sensitive, got a good backbone to it. You could really differentiate the rocks to fish bites and uh, when those lighter bites were hitting. But on those crankbaits, you usually don't have to worry about that. That's why I think this will be a great walleye rod too and all around rod. Um, it's got a great tip so you can just feel the lightest action. So if you're hitting that rock or weed, you can kind of differentiate it for sure from a fish and uh, hopefully get more hook sets on not big sticks and whatnot, but that always happens. And uh, yeah, just eight pound line, the stream side reel as well, worked great, the drag was awesome as you've seen today in the show. Um, with the spinning gear, we're using, uh, all I was using today was the live target brown trout, the medium size, or I guess this is the larger size. There is no medium size in this. The smaller one I love for small creeks too. Um, I know Hooked Up just released a new hook for me, the Magic Mitch. It's uh, 
going to be an awesome all around little crankbait too. It has uh, more of a goldy black, but will imitate your suckers, your shiners and everything. So check that out at Hooked Up and you're going to see it in some videos coming up. But yeah, for spinning gear, amazing rod, great casting. Like I picked it up that day, I was hitting that one foot range off the bank, like every cast. So real great rod. For the fly gear, we were using the Streamside Elite fly rod. Great rod as well. Um, five weight, great all around rod. Like this is gonna be your bread and butter for everything. If you're looking for a fly rod, get this one. It'll be great for all your streams and everything. Um, I'd recommend it for your starter rod. Great rod. Uh, we're using uh, small nymphs and uh, woolly bugger speed heads as well as San Juan worms. Red and brown worked great. And uh, yeah, great trip. And that gear really helped out. Didn't have any problems with it. So hopefully that will help you picking out some new stuff for this summer. time on the Bow River with Nick from Bow River Bank Robbers. Just a great time. It's a blast taking the jet boat up. I know he does drift boating too. And end of April, it's just gonna get better from here. So make sure you book that trip. And uh, hopefully we can get the legend out soon too. We're probably three weeks away for most of the local lakes. So that'll be a blast as well. Upcoming, we'll be on the rivers, hopefully as much as I can. We got our new baby, me and Aaron uh, Bennett just came and we just got on the acres. So we've been crazy busy, but thanks for your patience. The podcast is back on too, starting next Tuesday. So as long as this airs and you just watched it, it'll be next Tuesday. But thanks again. Hit that sub button if you enjoyed the show and we will see you on the water. <laughs>